Hey there, it's me, Bastian, and in this video I want to show you that AI-assisted patent drafting has actually arrived. So, I've spent the weekend to set up a little AI-based language model, which runs locally on my laptop, so there's no confidentiality issues involved. And this AI can take a patent claim as input and generate a pretty solid first draft of a patent application. So, I'm going to show you the demo in a second. Then I'm going to be talking about some of the wider implications for how I will use these tools to draft patents in 2024. And then at the end of the video, I have a big announcement. So stick around to the end. But now, first of all, let's jump onto my laptop for the demo. Part one, how to draft a patent with AI. So for this demo, I am using a piece of software called LM Studio, which you can download for free from the internet. It's basically a graphical user interface into which you can download all sorts of um, uh, open source LLMs to run completely locally on your laptop. And for this demo, I'm using the Vicuna 13B model, which you can download for free from Hugging Face. What are we going to input into the LLM? A title of the invention, some bullet points on the current state of the art, uh, about disadvantages of the state of the art, and about the objective of the invention, and a set of claims. And for this demo, I'm going to use four prompts from my personal prompting template library to draft the sections technical field, background, and then the summary for the claims. So let me start a timer so that we can see how long it takes to create the draft. And let me go offline to make sure that no data is sent anywhere. Let me start the LM Studio. Let's load the Vicuna model and let's input the first prompt. The first prompt is pretty straightforward. It says, you're a patent attorney. I want you to write a European patent application with me. First, let's write the section technical field. For context, I'm going to give it uh, the title of the invention. And for this demo, we are going to draft a patent application about an AI assisted patent prosecution software. The instruction is complete this sentence. The present invention generally relates to the field of placeholder and more particularly to techniques for placeholder. So I'm going to take this prompt and put it into the LLM. Now the Vicuna model is processing the prompt and will come up with its response. Here we go. The AI says the present invention generally relates to the field of artificial intelligence, AI, and computer assisted patent prosecution, and more particularly to techniques for utilizing AI algorithms and natural language processing, NLP, to assist patent attorneys and examiners in the drafting, review, and prosecution of patent applications. So um, maybe I wouldn't in have included examiners here, but Overall, I think this is a pretty good start. What I'm going to do is I'm going to copy the output uh, from the LLM into a little document I've prepared here, which just has the title of the invention and um, the headings for the different sections we're going to be drafting. So technical field is done. Now, the second prompt will be about the background section. Um, I'm copy gonna copy this and put it into the LLM. So this second draft uh, says, now let's write the section background. For context, uh, we're giving the LLM some information about the current state of the art, really just raw uh, bullet points like, patent drafting is a highly manual task. Some patent attorneys perceive patent drafting more as an art form than an engineering activity. Then we're gonna give it some disadvantages to chew on. Writing the claims requires human intellect and strategic decisions, but once the claims are finalized, writing up the rest of the patent application involves a large portion of easy, repetitive tasks. AI and LLMs currently not used in production due to confidentiality concerns. And then lastly, we're going to give it the objective. Enable a more streamlined patent drafting process by way of AI automation in a secure manner. And the LLM has already started producing its output. I'm going to time-lapse until um, the LLM is done. 
All right, this is the background section. Again, I'm going to copy it into the document like so. Now let's move on to the third prompt, which will be for drafting the summary section of claim one. I'm going to copy this into the LLM. Uh, now, the example invention I came up with for this demo is as follows. Claim one says a software product comprising one or more function modules, each configured to assist a user in one or more tasks for drafting a patent application, wherein at least one of the function modules is configured to access an AI system comprising one or more language models, wherein the AI system executes within a secured computing environment. And a second piece of information we are feeding into the LLM is the technical advantage of this claim. The secured computing environment enables secure use of AI for patent drafting without jeopardizing the novelty of the invention or the confidentiality requirements of the drafter. And we see that the LLM has already started producing its output. I'm again gonna time lapse until the LLM is done. Okay, and here we go. The summary section for claim one is finished. We can see that the LLM has done a pretty nice job in um, breaking up the claim into its individual elements. And then for each element, uh, the LLM has inserted some kind of explanation of what it all means, and then a nice explanation of technical advantages of the respective claim element. So let's take this and copy it into our document again. Now, last prompt is for the dependent claims. So I've come up with a number of um, dependent claims and some style and formatting instructions. So we will take that and input it into the LLM. I am again going to time lapse until the LLM has produced its output, then I'm going to take the output and paste it into the document. And there we have it. We have the major part of the introductory portion of the patent application generated in just under 13 minutes just by giving it a set of claims and uh, the context information I was describing earlier on and all of this was created completely locally on my laptop. I'm gonna put a link to this document into the description so you can have a look yourself but in my opinion this draft is pretty is a pretty decent first draft of the patent application summary section. In fact, I think it's fair to say that you couldn't tell whether this draft has been created by an AI or by a young patent attorney associate. Part two, what are the implications for the patent attorney business? So in the old way of drafting patent applications, I as the patent attorney would receive an invention disclosure I would then draft a set of claims, discuss it with the client, and once the claims are finalized and approved, I would draft together with my team the description and the figures, and the output would be a patent application draft. So let's say that drafting the claims typically takes uh, roughly five hours in a, a normal patent application, um, and once the claims are done, uh, we spend, let's say, 15 more hours to draft the description and uh, the figures. Now, in the new way, using a tool like this, I would estimate that drafting the description and figures could be brought down to, let's say, maybe five hours to finalize and work on and expand the AI-generated draft we have just seen. So we've actually saved 10 hours of work here. Now, if we take those 10 hours and spend five more hours drafting the claims, or maybe even adding a second patent attorney colleague and drafting the claims uh, together, 
two human brains are better than one, right? And we take uh, the other five hours which we saved to discuss the case really more in depth with the client and to work on the invention description before we even start drafting the claims. I think this will boost patent quality to a great extent. So that's my overall point I want to drive home here. These tools are, in my opinion, to be used for smart AI automation. And with that, I mean AI can help the human patent attorney to better allocate the human brain power, to spend just more time on those intellectually challenging tasks like boosting the invention disclosure, discussing the case more uh, in detail with the client, spending more time drafting the claims and then saving a lot of time during the, let's say, less intellectual, intellectually challenging and more tedious tasks like drafting the, the description and the figure. So all in all, this then results in a higher quality work product all thanks to AI. Part three, the big announcement. So in 2024, I have some really exciting passion projects um, I will be working on. My plan is to build a, a secure offline patent drafting assistant. What I have shown you is of course just a very early alpha demo of what an LLM can do. I just um, spend one week and to set it up. I will also expand my prompt a template library for enhanced AI capabilities. I'm going to explore more generative AI use cases beyond patent drafting. And I'm also going to document and share my learning journey online. So if you haven't connected with me on LinkedIn, uh, maybe do that and also watch my YouTube channel because I will be releasing uh, regular videos where I will just share what I'm doing with these AI generative tools. Now, question to you. I was thinking about doing an AI patent drafting workshop and this workshop would be um, exclusively for patent attorneys. Doesn't matter if you are in private practice or in-house, as long as you are drafting patent applications in your practice, the workshop would be for you. Um, I would share my learnings, my tool pipeline and my specialized prompt templates also. And uh, the goal of this workshop would be to take you from zero knowledge to being able to set up your own AI patent drafting tool pipeline. This will include no boring presentations, but it will be a very hands-on and we will do practical work. It will be a workshop where we will, we will produce real results. Um, I was thinking about a workshop of about five hours and the price point of about 1000 euros. But I really would love to do this uh, in 2024, but uh, only if enough people are interested. So please do me a favor. And if you are interested in such uh, an AI patent drafting workshop, please fill out this form here and um, indicate your interest in such a workshop. Thanks so much and see you soon.